livechurch.tv begins I think livechurch.tv is a reflection of what God has done in my heart. Uh, the frustration that I had growing up as a non-Christ follower in a church, never being confronted aggressively with the gospel. And so Life Church is really a paradox. It's about uh, allowing people to be comfortable and disarmed, while at the same time confronting them passionately with the truth of who Jesus is. Right now we have 13 campuses, 12 with the physical presence, and we have one campus that meets online. And so what it is is a community of people that gather together each week online, uh, experience the same great worship, uh, teaching, the things that, the elements that kind of make up a typical life church experience. We don't have any one main campus. Our, our vision for multi-site is it's who we are rather than something that we do. And we believe that there are campuses yet to be birthed that will be larger than any campus we've seen, certainly anyone that would be an original campus. In, in order to utilize a live satellite feed like we do in our, our model, it's important that we have uh, our times lined up very carefully. And, and so what we have right now in terms of our weekend experience, we have about 18 minute worship set that happens with someone, a band and musician, worship leader that's local on each campus. And then it transitions to a 90 second transition with the campus pastor. Uh, and then all of the campuses are looking at the same clock that's all synchronized together. And, uh, and then at 19 minutes and 30 seconds into the experience, they transition uh, into the live satellite feed of the teaching component at that time. We have really just the most amazing graphic artists and video uh, producers, editors that will get together and we'll collaborate. And I'll direct it, but with a lot of wiggle room. And they'll come back with all sorts of ideas um, we'll put together really a whole piece of communication which is so much broader than just the 30 minutes teaching time. Then I sit back and just say, wow, I can't believe what we all accomplished together. And there's a real sense of fulfillment that everybody contributes toward the life change. Our goal and our purpose is to be an effective church at reaching people. Um, we look at that with our buildings, we look at that with our facilities. Um, you know, there's a lot of great $100 million, $200 million facilities that a person might be able to build. We can take the same resources and, and launch 200 campuses, and, uh, and we feel like we can connect with a lot more people ultimately that way. When a lot of people walk into our church, they'll look at what they see and say, okay, the key must be we're going to do video, or the key must be a multi-site model, or the key must be dressed in a certain way or whatever and those things would not be the key. Uh, I think the key really to any church maxing out is for the leaders to really discover who they are, the unique DNA that God has put in them, and then also look at the environment or the context in which they do ministry. Our goal is anytime someone steps into one of our campuses is to really disarm them and help them to feel very comfortable while at the same time confronting them with the reality of the gospel. So we're not about being multi-site. We're about leading people to Christ. And right now as a reflection of who I am, who our leaders are, the people that we have, it's the best expression of reaching people that we know. And we'll continue to do it. And uh, if it stops working or slows down, we'll try something different. <laughs>